My name is Marcus Escovedo, and I am a senior program officer at the John A. Hartford Foundation. The John A. Hartford Foundation, based in New York City, is a private national foundation that is focused on improving the care of older adults. The foundation was established in 1929 by the family owners of the A&P grocery chain, but now we're independent and all of our grant making and programs are really focused on delivering continuous, coordinated, comprehensive care to older adults that really is age expert. Uh, we believe that this has the power to transform uh, the delivery of health care, uh, lower costs for our country, um, and really meet the needs of um, our grandparents and all of us as we age. The John A. Hartford Foundation and the American College of Surgeons have a, a long relationship, really almost 20 years of work together through a grant-funded initiative that the foundation has supported at the American Geriatric Society, a sister organization to the college. And uh, through that initiative, a council of specialty societies has been formed uh, that span the surgical and related specialties and are really focused on improving uh, specialty care of older adults. And it's been a great relationship over those years. The Coalition for Quality and Geriatric Surgery project is absolutely critical right now, um, and for a number of reasons. First and foremost, our, eight, our population is dramatically aging. We have 10,000 baby boomers turning 65 every day. Uh, soon the entire country will look like Florida in terms of its percentage of older adults. Um, also, these older adults are living longer than ever before, um, and we, our population of uh, the over 85 uh, age group uh, is exploding. They will quadruple to about 20 million older adults uh, by 2050. And of course, with the advances in surgical techniques and skill and technology, we're now able to um, have 80-year-olds, 90-year-olds, 100-year-olds undergoing surgical procedures. At the same time, we know that the outcomes are not optimal for those older adults. Um, and so we have a moment right now to really dramatically improve care, particularly as our healthcare system moves towards a focus on value and quality in the care that is delivered. The American College of Surgeons is a fantastic partner uh, in this effort for the, uh, the Coalition for Quality and Geriatric Surgery project. Um, the college brings over 100 years of uh, experience and dedication to improving quality in surgical care. Uh, the college has an infrastructure through their various quality programs that the John A. Hartford Foundation felt was absolutely perfect uh, in terms of a fit for our philanthropic funding to partner with that infrastructure of the college uh, to develop out this initiative that can dramatically improve care of older adults. I think the impact of the uh, project that's focused on improving surgical care of older adults uh, has tremendous uh, potential for impact. Um, at the heart of it, uh, the program will be setting standards um, that all hospitals around the country can utilize to ensure that they are delivering optimal care to older adults. Um, it can give confidence to uh, people like my own father who chose to have his surgery three and a half hours away from his small Texas town where he did not have confidence in the care being delivered by the hospital there. Um, and really, most importantly, I think, uh, through this initiative, we will be focusing on um, looking at what matters most to older adults and their families. Um, and that means really understanding the goals and preferences of older adults. A 90-year-old uh, may not be as concerned with longevity and survival, but may be more concerned about functional outcomes and quality of life. This project has the potential to embed that perspective into all surgical care across the country. John A. Hartford Foundation is incredibly uh, pleased to be partnering with the American College of Surgeons. Um, this project focused on quality and geriatric surgery fits so well with many of our other initiatives that span the continuum of cares. So we're not only focused on acute care, but long-term care, primary care across all settings where older adults are receiving health care services, including the community. Um, and this partnership, we think, will be uh, incredibly important to uh, strengthening all of those other initiatives. And we're so grateful uh, to be working with the incredible leaders at the college um, that they've gathered together.